Hey guys, what's up anyone? I'm gonna try to make a quick video of like um, in Lich King we we can make MPQ files that don't have a list file in it, so it shows all up as uh, as uh, unnamed files, and so it, it kind of in a sense sort of protects your patches and such. So uh, yeah, so this is a video I'm gonna show you basically on Cataclysm and on Mr. Pandaria and such, and it's the same process for both clients. And uh, yeah, so let's get to it. So in this particular uh, um, thing that I'm going to show you, uh, this is using a, uh, a 406 repack and uh, that repack doesn't send custom item information through the uh, uh, game's cache. So you need to make like a, a, a custom BB2 files to see the, the custom item. So if I mouse over this item, it, uh, it says retrieving item info. All right, so I have to make a patch. And when you make the patch, basically uh, grab the latest version of the MPQ editor, which right now is version 772 on the website. Uh, it'll be listed as 771 for today's date. Uh, if you might get it later, he might do a little update later. He hasn't updated it in a while, but if he does make an update, it may be a different version. And uh, yeah. All right, so I gotta do a new MPQ, go to the folder where my shit is at all right and then uh name my mpq i'm gonna just i use folder mqs normally for uh my 406 but uh for the sake of this tutorial i'm gonna be making an, an actual mpq file so i'll call this uh six or something uh if you don't know how to make mpq file like if you don't know what numbers to put uh, it's basically the uh go a higher value than your current patch revision all right like 406 patch revision is 13623 i think right uh down here 13623 is 406 patch revision so if you make custom patches naturally you'd have to crack the exe to read custom patches i'll, I'll have a link in the description below to uh to vx's repost of uh of of crack tools for um for uh, various versions of, of, of the client. And uh, yeah, so to make customs for my particular 406 would be 13624 and higher and such, okay? So that's why I'm, I'm doing this 13706 because it's higher than my patch revision. Okay, hit save, go next, and make sure this is on uh, the game compatibility. Make sure it's at as a Mr. Pandaria. All right, hit next and just put a value in there, like 65,000 or something. All right, uh, put next, finish. And then for these, I need to put this folder inside of here to see my custom item. All right, and then just close it out, launch the game, log in. And uh, forgot to show you the file, but it is unlisted. So let me just uh, log in so I can show you that and then I'll show you the patch afterwards. So yeah, but so uh, as you can see, the custom item now says custom two on it. The one I had moved earlier is no longer a question mark, and so on and so forth. And I can equip it, and so on and so forth, and all that good stuff. All right, so yeah, and to look at the patch, you'll see that it's just got file zero zero zero, file zero zero one, and there's no list file and no attributes file. All right, so there's that. And then for Mr. Pandaria, same deal. I got the Mr. Pandaria client open here. All right, um, the data I'm going to be adding in is basically I modified this lower portion of the login screen's uh, legs things to like a greenish color. All right, so to that. All right, so a greenish color. All right, so uh, close out the Mr. Pandaria client. Go to my Mr. Pandaria data folder, which is over here. All right, I need to launch the current version of mpq editor got a new mpq go to that folder all right and then make a new mpq i'm going to call this uh let's just call it 84 and just go higher than my last custom patch again it's um it's basically you take your patch revision which if if i run the executable at the bottom right hand corner we'll see the patch revision and you just got to make it higher than that so it still says 414 but it doesn't have that do i now it ends at 273 i believe was the 
retail patch. Yeah. All right. So two uh, one eight two seven three. These are my customs. So yeah, two seven three was the last retail patch. And uh, yeah, so basically just make a number that's higher than your highest retail patch. All right. And uh, that's pretty much it. And of course, crack it so we can use. Uh, I, I don't believe for 548 I used the cracker. I cracked it myself, which took a long time, but there should be crack tables out. If anybody's got 548 and they're using Drake's repack uh, and they want my EXE, I'll share it. Just let me know. All right. Uh, it's not perfect because I did it myself. I didn't use a crack table, so it's got some. It can hang the game or crash the game. Not crash, but. If you try to close out the game at certain points, it doesn't close out, and you have to open up like task man, uh, like task manager, and you have to close it out that way. All right, so yeah, it's, it's not a perfect crack because I don't do this very often. It was my first time at it, and I just disabled a whole lot of shit, and yeah, stuff happened. So yeah, let's get to it. So uh, let me make this file. So one eight two eight four here. Hit next. Uh, same thing as before, game compatibility, make sure it's uh, on Mr. Pandaria, not World of Warcraft or anything else. Alright, hit next, uh, again 65,000 for the file list, or, or uh, max file size. And um, I'm just going to add my junk in, so grab this folder, put it in, we're good. Close this out, if I open it back, if I open it up, you'll see that it's just it has a BLP and it's XXX which was the PNG file and such from there because I had two files in here and I had a BLP and a PNG all right so yeah that's that all right so the next thing I gotta do is just go into the game so if I just open up the game it'll load up that patch and you'll see that it has green uh, bottoms on it. all right so yeah there we go so all right, that's pretty much it. Uh, thanks to Phantom X and Salton for helping me out with this. The original method I was doing this for four six was a little different. Uh, it got the same. It, it, it got the job done, but it, it only worked for four six and required like two extra steps. So yeah, this way is a lot better. And uh, shout out to those guys. I'll link them in the description below. Their channels and such. If anybody wants to check them out. Anyway, so yeah, peace out. Thanks. Bye bye.